Hello everyone. Today we are going to work on replication of heavy attack. So here, let me look at these two players. And now let me perform a heavy attack on this character. So here, as you can see, the heavy attacks are properly replicated among uh, the instances of the game. So it's replicating from client to client and client to server. Now if I do the same thing using the server character, you can see it works properly from client to server as well. Okay, so this is what we are going to work on today. And before we get started, I'd like to remind you, you can download the project files of this project and all other thousands of projects that I have done in my channel from the Patreon page. Once you become a member, you can download anything without a limit. I'll leave the link in description below for that. And also, this uh, tutorial is a part of this action RPG with gameplay ability system tutorial series I'm doing. You can check out the complete tutorial series in my channel. And let's get back to today's tutorial. Alright, so last time we worked on the heavy attack, press and hold, so weapon gets eliminating and slow down and then do the attack but uh, this is still not in a stage where I do any additional damage also we haven't tested this behavior in multiplayer so now let's do that now we are going and uh, let's do that and see what happens okay first I will test with the server It is working fine from it is replicating fine from server to all the clients now let's test with the client oh it's not visible from the server now this guy is this guy is the client so if I press and hold well it doesn't work at all okay so why not to understand that let me open my character and charge attack so this charging effect only happens if the character has this heavy attack tag present in the character and I set it where do I set it? Here. But if I run this on a client, I don't think this will work. This will be applied to the server as we apply in this gameplay effect. This will be only present within the client. Well, even in the client, it's also not working as we saw. So uh, let's create a function in in the character apply gameplay if effect uh, and oh I can't replicate this so we may have to convert this to a event right apply gameplay effect now I can no oh sorry I dragged the wrong component here apply gameplay effect to self now here I'll promote this as a parameter and I'll mark this for event to 
run on server and also we would need another function another event clear game play effect this also needs to run on server Here. Uh, to clear a gameplay effect bring gameplay effect uh, by source effect okay no uh, previously we used this function remove active wake effects with ground attacks so let's use the same let me copy this and promote this tags as a parameter and I'll remove this first parameter I had this is also running on server okay now instead of this I'll use let me break this apply gameplay effect and this is heavy GE heavy attack so we don't need to connect anything here because we are this is already defined in the event self okay and for this also clear gameplay effect we don't need to call this and I'll mark as heavy attack all right now let's test and see what happens let's test with the client now client is visible in all three windows press and hold yeah it is working now great now let's test from the server as well okay it's now replicating properly okay now let's clean this additional events here let's add a comment game play facts sorry I rec deleted the required one also okay let's start so thanks for watching next time we will work on how to uh, make additional damage or additional features for the heavy attacks when the heavy attacks are landed on enemies and see you in the next episode goodbye hello everyone today we are going to work on how to replicate heavy attacks so as you can see here i'm testing with the client smaller windows are clients if i press and hold now the heavy attacks are working on the clients as well and they are properly replicating to the other instances of the game including other servers and other clients and the server so here now let's test it with the server press and hold as you can see it replicates properly okay and with this client also somewhere over here oh okay now the replication is working the other thing that I need to test is uh, when I do a heavy attack uh, now we need to rework on the time where the attack lands so here now let me hold me do one attack so as you can see while I was holding the attack 
see the blood appears there that's because let me open my adaptability j attack sword so here this is no longer used so let me remove that uh, this this is where we check the damage and as you can see here we do that after 0.4 seconds but this timing is not correct if we are doing a heavy attack so if we are doing a heavy attack we should do we should waste uh, have some additional delay but how do we know that for that let's see here get adapter get ability system component and here we can check if we are in the heavy attack mode uh, contains no tags has any machine tags and here let's check if the character contains the heavy attack tag if yes the character is doing a heavy attack that means instead of 0.4 seconds we should wait how do we do the slowdown yeah additional 0.2 seconds so i guess let's do a select based on this if it is true let's say at point 0.6 seconds otherwise point 0.4 seconds and now this is valid for the ending ability as well so here also i'll use the same value plus point two seconds it sh should be enough to properly finish the ability okay now let's check the AI is too aggressive it's not letting me attack let's land a smaller attack right no it's still not correct okay not correct no actually the way we do this check is wrong we initially should wait point per seconds anyway and then if we have after that if we have this additional delay yeah, after this time if we still have this heavy attack then we should wait an additional point two seconds otherwise we don't need to wait at all and here now this is wrong oh well this is not wrong i'll add 0.5 here okay okay so to fix the timing the first one first time didn't work so what i had to do is this here also i had to add uh, additional delay node and make the same delay as here before ending the ability now it works perfectly let me show you see now the attacks the heavy attacks and the damaging sinks properly Okay.
great next time let's work on how to make additional damage when we perform a heavy attack okay so thanks for watching as always updated project files will be available for the download in the patron page link could be in the description below and see you in the next episode goodbye